students are often confronted with the problem of not knowing what they don't know. So it's a challenge because you're not sure where to go find an answer. You don't even know where to start. That's where the relationship with the advisor becomes key. They approach the conversation um, genuinely curious about uh, what your goals are, maybe what your struggles are. We set you up for success by connecting you to three key advisors. Your faculty advisor, your academic and career advisor, and your undergraduate peer mentor. Across our support network, there is always someone to either answer your question or connect you to the correct person or resource. While I was a freshman at Catholic, I really didn't know what I wanted to study. Spoke with my advisor, said I'm kind of interested in everything, um, so I needed to narrow it down. And we decided I should take an intro psychology class. Two years removed from that conversation, I am a BA psychology major, also studying finance in the Bush School of Business. My sophomore year, I took a sales class and realized that sales was something that I wanted to pursue. So I was connected with the advisor for the sales program and I absolutely fell in love with the program and with the minor. Academic services provided me with kind of like a plan for college, um, but also a plan for my life to look forward, um, maybe four years like you do in college, into a career. In any job interview, they're going to ask you, what's your five year plan? Once you're on the job, you'll always be asked that question of like, what are you doing five years from now? What are you doing 10 years from now? So getting in the habit of sitting down as a college student, thinking through like the requirements to graduate, you're doing that for your planning process. And I think that academic planning practice as a student, they can apply that over and over again after graduation as well. So often the students who come in with a really um, well-defined plan of what they want to do after graduation typically involves a lot of different elements. It's usually their degree, they have a minor, they're usually involved in athletics or student clubs or leadership. For those students who have a lot going on, the coordination of completing your academic requirements, navigating extracurriculars, becomes very complicated. And that's where, as an advisor, I can help them choose their courses very carefully. Even if advising just looks like it might be helping you with your tracking sheet or what classes you need to take, if you can develop a real relationship with your advisor like I was able to do, it can turn into a lot more and can turn into a lifelong mentoring. We help students learn how to navigate the enrollment process, how to plan ahead over their four years. All of that advanced planning, having windows, you have that as an adult after graduation. So I think we give students some of those transferable skills. So I'm a senior and I just accepted um, a dream job in my eyes and it wouldn't have been without my advisor.